<laughs> the only thing we need to make now is a slide out tray for the MIDI keyboard. And that's gonna be in a future video. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna build the sides for the shelf that goes in the hole where the MIDI keyboard is gonna stand on the top. So we're gonna build the sides first and then we're gonna build the uh, deck and then after that we're gonna build a piece on the back, put it all together and mount it on the sliders inside of the hole in the middle of the desk. That's a lot of stuff, so let's just get sewing. There we go, spot on. All right, so that's the two pieces for the sides. Now let's make the bottom piece and the back piece. So, the bottom piece that we're going to make now is 85.3 times 38.5. Let's go ahead and cut some wood. We did it! Jesus Christ, that took a long time. Okay, so for the back piece of the slide-out tray for the MIDI keyboard, I'm just gonna use one of these slats that I made for my acoustic panels. If you haven't seen that video and want to check it out, you can click up here. <laughs> With the grain, very nice. Against the grain, not nice. Okay, moment of truth. That's a good start. Oh, this is gonna be nice. Side pieces. Then the last one here. Oh, that's tight. That's tight. Okay. It doesn't fit. So what we need to do is to cut freaking two millimeters of this bottom piece and then try again. It's gonna be so hard to only cut off two millimeters. I'm gonna try my very best. Nice. The next day. All right, it's now the next day, all of a sudden. And look what we made yesterday. We made a freaking shelf. Uh, and that's very nice. But I ran into some serious problems about the sliders. I tried to make it fit. Uh, but it didn't happen. <laughs> I f***ed it up. Here's the thing, the sliders are supposed to go in here. But for some reason, on one side, they fit perfectly. But on the other side, 
they fit in the front and then they get stuck. So something in here is just totally uneven, which I cannot believe because I made it myself. From here we have two options. Option number one is to try and make the sliders fit. That's gonna be freaking precision work and I think I'm not the guy to do it. The second option is to just use it without, because check this out. 100% <laughs> works. It's doing what it's supposed to do. It's just leaning on the top of the desk. I guess it's, it's not like the most uh, glamorous way of making a slide out tray for your MIDI keyboard, but it is a slide up tray for your MIDI keyboard. For now, I'm actually pretty uh, like, uh, it's okay with this. <laughs> it works, it's totally steady. I guess if it, if it works, it works. So yeah, I hope you found this video helpful um, and you got something out of it. I got a shell for my MIDI keyboard, so I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy. If you want to make one of these yourself, I have a blueprint in the description that you can check out. And other than that, it's just uh, it's nice that you're watching this video. I appreciate that a lot. Um, I'll see you in the next one, I guess.